Yo, what it is, man? It's my tenant, you know, we've been in the field. But look, man, it's my first podcast, so you know I had to make you know I had to make this something special. Next time maybe I'ma have somebody sitting right here. Uh, you never know, I might get a new set or some shit. I'm starting somewhere, you feel me? That's his motherfucker point. You gotta start to see, you feel me? But let's get to it. In my first podcast, so you know I gotta make this song good, something special. So we finna get right to it. We talking about straight sports today. You feel me? And I got my little dogs over there at Vanguard. My little dogs over there at Forest. You feel me? It's been a lot of shit talking going on. So that's what really, that's what really motivated me to do this shit. You feel me? We got Forest three and six, and we got Vanguard nine and zero. You feel me? I just got boys dropping the V. It all kind of crazy shit. You feel me? I got niggas talking about the scope from last week with Forest. You feel me? It was, I don't know, but like this shit crazy before I just had to do this shit. You feel me? So what's up? What it up, man? But before I get in too deep, man, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe on this video. Make sure you subscribe, man. Just subscribe. Subscribe to the fucking video, man. Real nigga shit. Subscribe to this shit. But, yo, we finna get right into it, man. Like, cause it's been, it's been a lot of shit talk. So, let's look at, we gonna, we gonna get into some of this, you feel me? Because, just because it has been a lot of shit talk, I just wanna bring up something right quick. Vanguard, them boys, now I don't know who they played last week. Springstead, 33-0. Shut up, them boys, yeah, shutting up. I heard about Fuzz, but I went, now I went at the game, I was out of state, man. Let me see what they talking about. Who they played last week. Down, them boy played Buhol, 75, sound. Swoof. Listen, but you can't always, look, I don't know. I don't know how them boys, I don't know how they coaching over there for us. Or none of that shit. But it's either a real talent thing or it's either a coaching thing. So I, you can't even say, I ain't even going to say too much because I wasn't though. But me just like, that sounds like a coaching thing. Like Me as a coach, I feel like I don't give a fuck who you got. Like, if you, if you if you call them the right shit, that shit not happen. You feel me? But I don't know. I wasn't though. You feel me? I wasn't though. We worrying about this week, though. Back out of motherfucking boys. Back out of boys. I'm pretty sure boys don't even want to talk about that shit, hear about that shit. I'm going to ask them about that shit. You know I got to ask y'all boys about that shit because I want to know what the fuck went on. I want to know what the fuck went on because I wasn't though. You feel me? But damn. Them boys put up a basketball school. But shit, what the fuck happened to my music, man? You know, it's early in the morning. I had to get me right, get my mom right, stimulate myself. You feel me? If you know, you know. You feel me? But anyway, man, look, I'm trying to get some. I'm trying to get some guests on here. You feel me? Have somebody on the phone. How y'all hit hit somebody? You feel me? I got I got a few ready now. But we finna see what they talking about, man. We finna see what they talking about. I finna call the first person right now. I finna call the first person. Hit my dog. My, my, my dog, Pooh, man. He gonna tell you what he think or whatever. Let's see what he talking about with the game. How he feel about the game. Oh, y'all can hear his ass. Yo, what's up? what's up, my nigga? Nah, cool, man. So you still at work? Right huh? I said you called at the right time. Oh, I did. Yeah, you did. I bet, man. You know, I just wanted to talk about this forest shit, man. How you feel about that shit? Yeah, I said I just had wanted to call you about the uh. The whole Forest situation. See how you felt about it? You talking Forest and Vanguard? Yeah. You ready right now? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm ready. How you feel? Y'all know what's gonna go on. They finna get the ass whooped. Who finna get the ass whooped? Forest. Forest? They got their ass whooped last week. 7 to 75. So <laughs> what I still tell you. <laughs> <laughs> they whooped 
y'all last two back then. So you already know what the hell is going to go happen. Hey, we ain't talking about us. I ain't even play on that <laughs> team, my oh boy. So look. <laughs> so look. So look. Look, so you don't feel like there ain't no, like, there ain't no chances. That nigga's the ass. That nigga Damn. can't beat nobody right now. Damn. They can't even beat they down themselves if they wanted to. My boy, <laughs> hey, 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 they, hey, they got three, three wins. You say what? I said they got three wins. What the fuck three wins gonna do with an undefeated team? You never you know. You supposed to be proud about three wins. Hey, so you don't believe in the underdog? Hell yeah, nah. Who gonna be proud about three wins, bro? Come on, now. Three wins. Oh, what's y'all rest of shit? We ass, but we got three wins, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, man, come on, man. You already know what the hell's gonna happen, bro. Hey, you gonna be there, ain't Yeah, I'm going to that homecoming game. Man, look, man, look. <clears throat> Damn. See, I'm thinking you was finna come on this bitch and be like, maybe they, if they did this, then they could win. But you just... They can't do, they can't do nothing. So I ain't gonna say what they can do. Only thing they can do is lose. <laughs> Dude, it ain't gonna be what they can do this and that shit. I ain't gonna lie, they switched a little offense or nothing, but they still gonna lose, though. Everybody that rock came to Vanguard. Yo, man. So, like... Yeah, like, I know you be going to the games and shit sometime. Like, who you who you think going to have a, 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 a big game this week? Uh, out of the player? Yeah. Sure. I heard, I heard that, um, what's the call it? Remember you taking off? Who that? Remember? Uh, Remember? Isaiah Guy. Was it, yeah, uh, I thought, yeah, Lizette, I'm going to die out. Yeah, Josh, too. What's that one jit, man? Jit to all the positions, too. Big What's his number? I think he got like four, four, four. Oh yeah, that's like uh, that. that's uh, Fred, Fred, yeah. Fred. He a dog. Yeah. He a dog. He a dog for sure. Yeah, I think well, he a junior. Ain't he? Ain't he? Uh, ain't he a junior? Nah, he like a um, like a sophomore type. Oh, he a sophomore. Yeah. Hey, but hey, Fred, but he gonna be some shit. But he gonna be some hell, boy, my boy. Cause look, I be seeing you, boy. If you if you a sophomore, nobody ain't fucking with you, my boy. I'm telling you that right now, him. Yeah. Who, but shit, who else you was saying? I think shoot, there's a couple other niggas, but that's all I really know right there, shoot. And uh, and uh, Randall. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. The twins real good. Yeah, Randall. Ball, that nigga be balling. He can play. He can play quarterback too a little bit. My nigga Diddy be coming down. Man, look, look, man. They got like yo. My boy got a team. I ain't gonna lie. Like, like we can keep naming on that team. What yeah, about Forrest, man? What about Forrest, man? I can't name nobody on force. Come on, man. Shoot, nobody. So you can't name nobody on force. <laughs> Shoot, do you like you can name somebody? They got what, seven or seventy-five. Who can you name on that team who get what like that? Nigga, they got commits. Yeah, what what he gonna do? You feel me? You go. So you, there ain't no more dollars at four thirty dollars. Man, look, man, can't nobody over the ball like that. Hey, look, I ain't picking no sides. So look, don't don't let this shit uh, seem like I'm picking sides. You feel me? This shit is mutual with me. But I'm picking sides. You know what I'm saying? I'm a Vanguard alumni. <laughs> you know I'm, I'm going to pick no sides regardless. <laughs> so it's dead with you. Even if I was, even if I did was a Force alumni, I'm still going to say, oh, yeah, Force to get that ass with. They already know that. All right, man. So, look, you feel like, so, like, we see right now that you on Vanguard all the way. They're going to win. So, how you feel like them boys going to go uh, the rest of the season and playoffs and shit? You know they're going. They're 9-0. Hey, man. When they get in that third round, you know what I'm saying? Get kind of a little spooky. But, you know what I'm saying? I don't know. But it's like they should be playing chicks right now. You feel me? They ain't how it used to be. Everybody was big. You know what I'm saying? Like, everybody small. So I don't know. You know, I just know they get in that third round. Hey, that's when they get hit. That's when they get real. You know, Vanguard don't never make it past the third round. So you don't think they're going to make it past the third? I hope they do. I ain't saying they ain't, but you know what I'm saying? Sound like it. It sound like, like it, nigga. I want Vanguard to make it, shoot. Like I said, everybody ain't like how they used to be. Everybody's small, so you only have that, what? Once every blue moon person that be wrong on the team, Vanguard got everybody that's wrong, so. You know what I'm saying? 
you. They come out there and dominate, do what they got to do, and make them get them plays right. They can go to state. They can go past the round. Well, shit, they're from the city, so anybody that get that far, I hope y'all get that, you hear me? Yeah. But shit, my nigga. We appreciate you for uh coming up on the event, my boy. You my first, my first uh, what's the word I'm looking for? I'm high as shit. Anyway, you the first one that spoke on this, so I appreciate you, my nigga. You feel me? Yeah, man, most definitely, man. Love. Love, man. Love. Be safe, right. bro. You too. Damn, man. He already, hey, he already sticking the uh. He sticking straight to uh, Vanguard, you feel me? He don't feel like there's no chance. But you got to be real and be like, damn, can you blame him, though, because 75, 7. That got to be a, a confidence killer, though. I ain't going to lie, that shit got to kill your confidence. Fuck with you. Like, any nigga, like, any, any person that's, like, serious about himself or want the best for himself, like me, that'll fuck me up. I ain't gonna lie. For me to even lose, I hate losing. I hate losing, but like when we used to lose back then, when I used to want to fight the coaches, the whole team, I hate losing. You feel me? So I know that if I ever got my eye beat, ever got my eye beat that that fucking that much, yeah, that'll fuck my motherfucking pride. <laughs> that'll fuck my pride right there, boy. I try to tell you. I try to tell you. So like I don't, I wouldn't even know what to uh, do. But hey, check me out. We gotta, we gotta. Uh... <laughs> so look, check me out, man. We done spoke to somebody on the outside. You feel me? I, I'm trying to get in contact with B right now. But in the meantime, we might have somebody that go to Vanguard on the team. And I can tell you a little bit more <laughs> about it right now. You feel me? How you feel? Then my nigga Trey, man. I'm 52. Let's see what them boy got to say. Yo. Yo, what's up? Say what happened to my nigga? What's up, nice? Say bro. Uh, my, I already recording this shit. I just had to call you and shit. Um, get a few questions out of you. Yeah. All right, so look. I know y'all see the Snapchat shit going crazy, man. No boy dropping the beat, man. How that shit make you feel? Man. I mean, I already know this for the catch of dogs, so I don't really mean nothing. <laughs> just another game. Got to play hard. The boys, this is their last game of the season, so they go play hard. They go do anything. Oh, this their last game? Yeah, this this all, even if they win. But they ain't going to win, though. They ain't going to win. So, look, man, look, I ain't even talked to nobody from uh, Forest yet. But uh, I had talked to a couple of alumni that go to Vanguard and shit. Um, you don't feel like there's nobody over there on Forest side that's going to get y'all a problem tonight? Well, not tonight, but Friday night. I mean, I feel like they got good players, some athletes, but I mean, our team the better overall team, so they gonna have to. He gonna have to be a superman to, to score or something, cause our defense lot. I got our offense over their defense too. They got players though, but we got more players who could lock them down. So, so you don't even feel like them boys gonna need touch the end zone. Nah, I don't, I don't see them touching hands on. <laughs> yeah, yeah, now, so look, so look, B-Hook put up 75. B-Hook put up 75, man. You seen that? Yeah, yeah. How that shit made you feel? Like, 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 what you had? <laughs> I feel like that was bad coaching. If I'm a coach, bad coach the, yeah. game, the game really should have been 48, what, 48 seven. I feel like if I'm the coach, if the pass ain't working, why keep passing? They had three pick sixes. If I'm a coach and I'm losing that bad, I'm going to run the ball out. Just run the time out. Yeah, yeah, that's what I was saying, too. Because, look, I ain't go to the game, but but just the school, like, the, the, the school just sound like that was just bad yeah. coaching. Yeah, it was ridiculous. Like, I mean, y'all already getting beat. Man. I'm running the ball. Like, when we played Westport, 
I think our Aaron score was like 20, what, 20, 22 to 0. They coach, we was beating them. He just started running the ball out, so the time just kept running out. Yo, hell yeah. See, look, that, that's shit, that's smart because if not, y'all would have just kept running that shit up. Yeah, and that's what Bios did. They took advantage of it. Three pick sixes. They had a force out of muff punt, put them. I think they scored on that. Just It's just mistakes. Mm -hmm. And that's what that's what we trying to get better at because going to the playoffs, you can't have mistakes like that. Yeah, for sure, for sure. See, y'all boys been looking uh, real crazy. Y'all got, oh, yeah. I see y'all beat Buhos. What the world? They're not Buhos. Um, Bellevue, um, 42 7. That was supposed to be a uh, city game, too, the biggest in the city. Yeah, that was basically for the district championship. Okay, okay, okay. So, look, going back to Ford, man, and talking about the scores, what did you predict y'all score to be Friday night? My score? I'm going to say, well, this is what I want. I want 45 and up. But the score for me, I'm going to go ahead and give them, I'm going to say 42 0. 42 0? Yeah, but I want to run the score up. It's senior night, too. All the seniors going to take this to heart on our team. Our last home regular season game. And we already got home advantage in the playoffs, but this like the last, like, right, regular season game for us. So well, they know the stands like, going to be packed, too. Yeah, and them boys from Forest already talking, dropping the V. Nah, something. <laughs> can't, we can't come out there playing like a day. We got to come out, come out how we did against Bellevue. That energy got to be the same. Right there, right there. That's it, bro. Hey, look, I appreciate you coming on this bitch. Hey, um, go ahead and set yourself out and your jersey number and shit. Hey, for sure, for sure. Hey, this your boy Trey Parker, number 52. You already know what it is. Yes, sir, man. I'm boy up in the turn up, bro. But, hey, bro, appreciate it, bro. Real shit. Yes, sir. All right, BC. Yeah, you know what it is. You see what it is. You hear what it is, man. My boy Chase say he's 42-0, but he's trying to run the score up. But, yeah, man, back to that Forrest shit. Um, Because, bro, I know, like, Forrest got some Forrest got some athletes, bro. I done seen them, bro. Like, forgetting what Pooh said, Forrest got some athletes. I ain't know. But if it's go like that, and he's talking about um, pit sisters, I didn't even know they had three pit sisters. So, hey, yeah, but that's coaching, bro. I feel like it's coaching, bro. Like, I I had, uh, like, I went to Forrest my uh, freshman and sophomore year. And I know the coach, uh, what's his name, man? Coach Casey, he can't fucking coach. He can't coach for shit, bro. I'm telling you, he can't coach for shit. He, um, he the office of coach, but they think just because a nigga was good in high school that he can coach. But every nigga that play football can't coach, bro. And I guess they got them niggas out there. Them niggas can't coach, bro. They got too good of a players in the wrong position. And they ain't doing too They need to get them niggas out of there. You feel me? I ain't saying they need to get all them niggas out of there. But the main nigga they need to get out of there. You feel me? Because the shit look crazy. Come on, man. I don't know. Nigga like me, after the first pit six, we finna calm down right quick. Okay, we finna calm down. Eat their ass up in this run. And then when this run start tearing their ass up, that's when they start biting to the run. Then we finna try to hit them with nothing. But if it just ain't working and we tearing their ass up with the run, run the ball. You feel me? Nigga can't coach, man. Shit crazy, though. And see if we got somebody else, man. But like this good for the first one, man. I got two. First podcast. Starting in the car, gassing. And CBD right here, man. It's because CBD, that shit like, that shit for your body. Like I can feel CBD in my body, like, because I just worked out. And they was telling me, somebody told me that shit. Like, CBD is good healing, like, for the body. Especially when you sore and shit, it's really good. But, hey, man, I forgot. I almost forgot. The link is going to be in the description, man. Habits 365, 365 Habits, man. Hit the link in the bio and tell them my tell them two times refers you. And you will get a 15% off discount on Everything, man. When I say everything, I mean everything, man. The cleanest clothes that you could find. You feel me? I'm.
kind of rough right now, but yeah, hit that, man, hit the link in the description. Habits 365. Go check that out. But yeah, I'm trying to wait, man. I'm trying to wait, see if I get another call in and shit. See if I can get somebody else to pick the phone up. I might just call a nigga and just be like, hey, can I call you? And if he say, yeah, I'm going to just stick him in that conversation. I'm going to just try something right quick. So my boy Nick, cause I know he going to talk some shit. But you have to be 21. You got to be 21 years of age to purchase the CBD out of the store. No, I think it'll be. I think you can be 18. I think I don't know, cause it's like, cause it's not, it's not. I think you can. I hate when a nigga do this. He's talking about yo, nigga, answer the phone, man. But I don't need him be calling niggas like that though. So he probably like what the fuck. Hold on, now we might have some more like that. Oh, shit, hold on, I'm trying to. Yo. Hey, what's up, bro? Hey, listen, I'm on my podcast right quick. I just want to ask you a few questions. You on your who? My podcast for YouTube. Oh. Wait, you on live? Yes. The hell, nigga? Uh, what's up? You got me this quick. All right, so look, so look, so look. I know you know about the game coming up, right? With Forrest and Vanguard. Yeah. How you feel about it? Shit, Forrest going with their ass, I hope. Forrest? Yes, sir. You feel like Forrest going to win their ass? Yes, sir. Man, <laughs> listen, both of these teams having a rough season. Ah, oh, so look, so look, so look. My question is, how do you feel about the score? Because I got to bring this up because everybody got to have brought it up with everybody. So with Forrest losing. Cause I know you are a Forrest alumni. And that's real that you say that. This man lawyer. So look, how do you feel about the score uh, last week between Buholtz and Forrest? 75 to 7. Like, do you feel like that was coaching or you feel like the players were just better? Both sides. <laughs> what you mean? I feel like coaches could have, uh, both sides, real shit. All right. For example, whatever the players give us, all of that is reliable from us. It's, that's right behind. Damn, he breaking up. That's right behind the plate. Uh, you was kind of breaking up, but you were saying like you were saying like the coaches can make them do it, but they can't run the plays. No, I said the coach could uh, give them the plays, but the players like the teammates can't. You can't make them execute. You feel me? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I feel you. I feel you. I feel you. This question: What do you predict the score gonna be between Forrest and Vanguard? I'm going to say at least a good, I'm going to say 14 to 38. 14 to 38, boys? Yeah. That real, nah. Hey, y'all got my boy Nick, uh, uh, a fiend. We got him on there. Uh, check my boy out on motherfucking all platforms, matter of fact. NJ TMS. You know what it is, man. TMS NJ. Let's get it. Love. Yes, sir. Man, look. That was the most crazy one. No, I couldn't really hear what he said, but just because he said Forrest is going to win. I told you that 
I ain't had no size in this shit. But you gotta be real about some shit. Honestly, I feel like Ben got was gonna Do I feel like it's gonna be a game how Blue Hoes did Ben No, nah, I don't feel like it's gonna be no game like that. I just feel like Ben gonna win. You feel me? I fought old boys on every side, but I feel like the coaching is way different. You feel me? Way different. And Ben got might do have more athletes than Forrest. But Forrest got some athletes. You feel me? But this man say 14 and 38, that's what he said. Boys is gonna win. That's real, you feel me? Y'all got somebody rooting for you. So look, don't go in there thinking that ain't nobody rooting for you. Somebody rooting for you. Other than you people. I'm telling you. I think I got another. Okay, I got another one right now. <laughs> My nigga Allen. Hello. What's up, cuz? Shit, bro, nigga had just wanted to call you, but get your opinion, bro. I'm on live right now. What well, shit, I'm recording right now. What's good? So, shit, it's about uh, the game coming up this Friday, man. Forrest and Vanguard, man. How you feel about that? Man, Forrest, man. Them boys trash, man. <laughs> Vanguard can run over them boys. The score might be uh, 80 to 0, bro. 80 to 0? Hell, yeah. They just got beat 75 to 7. So you don't feel like Forrest can't do shit this week? It's their last game. They ain't like they ain't coming out there with no type of animosity. It's their last game. This some of them boys last time playing football. Man, I heard them niggas don't got no coat. I heard they coach be on that bitch drinking and everything. Man, them niggas finna get red though, man. <laughs> that shit finna be terrible. If you going out to the game, don't go. It's gonna be a waste of money and time. That shit gonna be over in the first quarter. <laughs> So, trash, man. <laughs> so, look. <laughs> so look, man. <laughs> the game last week, man, with Butte Hoes, man. Cause look, some people said, look, I was just talking to some people on um, Vanguard side, man. They said that they feel like. Why y'all losing? Y'all ain't focused. Y'all worried about the wrong shit. Y'all worried about the wrong shit. Y'all worried about the wrong shit. Wait, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. You say what now? I said, boy, losing because they be worried about the wrong shit. Yeah, shit, them boys trash, man. What's their record? Two and what? Six? Nah, they, uh, they three and six. That shit bad. You ain't finna beat Vanguard like that. Y'all gonna get beat worse than Bellevue did, shit. <laughs> Hold on, now, for us, have, uh, top, top, top of Bellevue. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> exactly, man. That's my point right there. They tired with them. So what you think they're not going to do there? Rending the ass over. That boy said they have you having Apple Watches on the sideline. Yeah, shit. We can play football with Apple Watch. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, shit. Man. So I'm, I'm on live right now. Hell yeah, talk your shit. Man, for y'all go do some shit, do some shit. You feel me? I'm old school, but... Y'all boys be on some other shit. I watched some of y'all highlights. That shit trash. Y'all <laughs> boy look terrible. I don't know if y'all coaches or what. Tell that fucking he better tighten up. Y'all wanna win some shit. You feel me? <laughs> y'all ain't finna go beat Vanguard like that. Cause you know Farmer finna come out there talking straight cash shit. <laughs> you know he gonna want a dog uh, for it. Y'all coaches don't. Y'all coaches not even like he over there drinking bill. How the fuck? How do y'all gonna beat Vanguard drinking bill? <laughs> <laughs> Bum <Bomb> high up. <laughs> man, man, I wouldn't come to the game, but I ain't finna waste my money. I'm finna watch it on Twitter. So you ain't even going like that bit? Hell nah. <laughs> I ain't know what it's gonna be. But they got beat 75 to 7. That's the basketball school. Why I said the same shit, cuz? That's a damn basketball school. Yeah, hey, I was talking to the other day. She talking about, she teach that for us. She talking about, yeah, this, I'm, uh, I'm only teaching for two more years and I'm gone. She talking about, boys, way different now. I said, I know. She said, they had dogs. <laughs> Man, so look. Some of them boys got some offers over there, though. <laughs> hey, my nigga, my nigga, uh, Bert, I fuck with Bert, bro. He should have left that fucking shit. Who else would have that good? I don't know 
nobody else over there that's good. He should have left and went to a different school because Ford making him look like he trash. He not even trash. It just the shit that he around. He should have left that motherfucker. Man, that boy said some shit. Nah, that boy done talk this shit. Yeah, shit. You, you played your senior year at the school, and you see your homeboy left him with the man guard. What's his name? Is a guy? Is there a guy? You see, he loved. He's smart. He should do the same damn thing he did with the man guard. <laughs> yeah, yeah would have been winning right now. Hell yeah, no, nah, man. And shit up for it for you. That's yeah, it, K, man. Damn, my nigga, you ain't got shit to say, bro. What you go? What you go put the bit on the video? Hell yeah. <laughs> they gonna be laughing at my ass. That's hey, hey, Nick said that oh, uh, Forrest is gonna win thirty-eight to oh, uh, fourteen. Who said that? Nick. Nick, dumb as fuck. Nick, dumb as fuck. Nick said Forrest gonna win thirty-eight to twelve. No, no. 38 14, that's what he said. Shit. He said, uh uh-uh, uh, Vanguard gonna come out there, uh. Man, Vanguard play trash and still be forward, <laughs> Real shit. He said he gonna come out underestimate. Nigga, nigga put their JV out there and be forward. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. How the fuck? I wouldn't even wanna play, bro. We just got beat 75 to. Wow, some shit. I wouldn't even want to play that week. Real shit. I wouldn't even want to play. But you done said some shit right there. I would have quit that game right now. <laughs> <laughs> I would have quit, man. So, well, oh boy. And I probably would have fought Coach Ash. <laughs> I'm going to put that on everything, boy. Bitch, that nigga be drunk. Hell no. Nah. Just be calling shit. And you know they got Coach Casey, sorry. He can't coach. And Coach Casey ain't going to say shit anyway. He's supposed, he supposed to be the head coach. He can't coach, coach nigga. Shit, I'm just saying how long he been there. Shit, he supposed to be the next coach up. <laughs> he don't want to do shit. You know nah, you know, nah, you know they ain't going to get to no nigga. Nah, they say Ackerman want to coach them, but they ain't want to let him coach. They fucked up. They tripped. I would have Ackerman right in that coach. Well, that would have been winning. And probably would have had more players over there. How you on got acting coaching? Yeah, nah, this bit better be crazy, though. Nigga, this my first podcast, my nigga. You going to the game? Shit, I don't even know. You know, I got a peep scene. Where's it going to be at? Boosa. That bit But no, I mean, I don't know. That My boy said that big up he did for no reason, man. But we gonna see. You feel me? But shit, my nigga, I appreciate you coming on that bit for sure, though. That bit gonna be turned, nigga. You had turned that bitch up. Yeah, sir, you already know that love. <laughs> yes, sir, love. That was-